What is a word? Susanna always wanted to know about everything. And whenever she wanted to know something, she would ask her mother. <clears throat> Mom, Susanna asked one day, what is a word? Well, said her mother, words are sounds that mean something. We use them when we talk. Your name, Susanna, is a word. When I say it, you know I'm talking about you. Then her mother picked up an apple. She said, apple is another word. When I say it, you know that I'm talking about a fruit like this one. But a word is not just something we say. It's also something we can write, said her mother. Let me show you. How are you feeling today? Happy, Susanna said. Happy is a word that tells me how you feel, said her mother. I'll write it down for you. Her mother wrote the letters on a piece of paper, spelling them out loud as she wrote. H-A-P-P-Y. Then she said, See, these letters stand for the sounds in the word happy. I'm not sure I understand, said Susanna. Then let's do another one, said her mother. Listen to the different sounds in the word sad. Her mother said the word very slowly. Sad. Do you hear the sounds? Yes, said Susanna. Now watch me write the word sad by using letters to stand for those sounds. S A D. Do you understand now? Susanna's mother asked her. Yes, I do, said Susanna. Let's do some more. OK, said her mother. What's this? Her mother held up a cup. It's a cup, said Susanna. That's right, said her mother. Now let's write the letters that stand for the sounds in that word. Her mother wrote the letters C-U-P. Now you look at the letters and tell me the word they stand for, Susanna. C-U-P. Cup, said Susanna. And what's this? Her mother was holding up a dish. A dish, said Susanna. Her mother wrote D-I-S-H on a piece of paper. There are many different kinds of words, her mother said. Some words tell us what people or animals are doing, like run, or sit, or beg. Or jump, yelled Susanna as she jumped into the air. That's right, said her mother. And we can write down letters that stand for each one. Run is R-U-N. Sit is S-I-T. Beg is B-E-G, and jump is J-U-M-P. So now do you understand what a word is? Asked her mother. Yes, said Susanna. Can you tell me? Asked her mother. A word is sounds that mean something, and a word is also the letters we write down to stand for those sounds, replied Susanna. And when you look at letters that someone has written down and figure out what sounds they stand for, you can say the word. Can you guess what that's called? Oh, I know, said Susanna. That's called reading. Right again, said her mother. And if you keep practicing, you will be reading before you know it. I can hardly wait, Susanna said. But for now, will you read to me? That would make me very happy, said her mother. The end. Terrific! Click on the next activity.
What is a word? Terrific! Click on the next activity. ABC Memory Match. Look at the alphabet letters on the cards. Can you find the matching pairs of things that start with the letters? Play! Pair. Pencil. Good try. Pair. Pencil. Try again. Pair. Pair. Terrific! Pig. Pig. Terrific! Pencil. Pencil. Good. P. Pears. Peanut. Pencil. Snowman. Spoon. Try again. Snowman. Snowman. Awesome job. Spoon. Spoon. Well done. Snake. Snake. Fantastic. S. Strawberries. Snake. Snowman. <coughs> Goldfish. Grasshopper. Good try. Guitar. Guitar. Terrific. Goldfish. Goldfish. Great job. Grasshopper. Grasshopper. Great job. G. Guitar. Goat. Goldfish. on the next activity. J Z A I G F W L X O V H C U M Y N B P K S T D E Q R ABC Words Cutout Puzzle Click on the next activity!
Club. Click on the next activity. Letters at the zoo. Look at the letters and pick the one you hear. Play. Pick. E. Great job. Pick. S. Well done. Pick. M. Try again. Awesome job. Pick. F. Nice try. Wonderful. Pick B. Good try. Excellent. Nice job. You found a prize! Click on an item below to choose your prize and collect your... Congratulations! 